Don't wait years to get this weathered-worn look. Make it happen now with a few simple steps. One of the keys to this look is the texture you create with a coarse wire brush attached to a drill. The brush is actually removing the soft wood, grinding it away and leaving behind the raised hard grain. Always work the tool with the grain of the wood and be sure to use proper protection. The grain on the edges of these pine rounds doesn't run in one direction like it does on the top. So when you're working the edges, try and follow the grain as much as you can. If the wire brush gets worn and you need to change it, be sure to wear gloves while you're handling it. Once you're satisfied with the texture, clean up all the dust so you can start staining. There are three different stains to apply. The first is driftwood. This is the only stain you'll apply as a solid coat, so be sure to get good coverage. Let that dry and then go back and sand the round to lightly expose some bare wood. Clean up any dust and then apply the next stain. Lightly brush on some dark walnut in a random pattern. That'll make the aging or weathering look more natural. And then remove it immediately with a rag. The final stain is ebony. Apply it lightly to random areas too and then wipe it away. And that's it. The stains and texture combine to create the look of years of aging and weathering without the weight.